When we got there, you couldn't see much from the outside, but I noticed that there was a little bit of smoke coming out of one of the eaves. We were going through several feet of roofing material with chainsaws and rotary saws trying to find the fire. We won't be able to access these books until this building is put back together again. We've got about three or four different locations scattered from Kansas City to Junction City that we're taking those books to to have enough space and store them until the rest of the library is put back together. We know that we will help rebuild these physical structures and the communities will bounce back because their congregating places are going to be alive and active again. We turn to you know, determining what parts of the walls were wet. They've got the great room that has some murals that we're working on saving that were painted directly on plaster, which was right above the fire. So that's another thing that's really important to the university is to try to save that and put that room back the way that it was before the fire happened. It takes an army of workers and a lot of people with a lot of heart to get this thing done. Books are part of us. They have all our ideas, our thoughts, our hopes, our futures are all embedded in those pages. Missing that would be missing a huge part of ourselves.